get it right, right? So Gomez has a question about verifying um, the business manager account. So yes, when you're verifying, when you want to verify a business manager account, you need to have a business website, which is your own domain. And uh, in fact, not just your own domain, you need to have an email that comes from that domain that you put in as your business domain. So that's the fundamental thing in order to get your business manager verified. But the Gomez problem over here is that he's selling only on Facebook Messenger uh, and Shopee and Lazada. So he was asking, was there any other way to get your ver business uh, manager verified if you don't have a business website or business URL? At the moment, as what I know of, you can't. This is a compulsory thing to get your business manager verified. You need to have a business domain, a website, and you need to actually change your email to the domain. As in like, for example, if I'm using tribeupacademy.com, I need to make sure I have an email, which is jason at tribeupacademy.com because all the notifications, uh, so the verification email and all that will actually go to my email. So that's how they verify a business manager. So the answer is no. However, Gomez, I just want to, you know, pretty quickly give you some assurance over here. Um, in fact, I only got my business manager verified sometimes in 2019. Uh, as I mentioned, I've been running ads on Facebook since 2010. In fact, 2009. Uh, for the longest time, for 10 years, if you look at it, I didn't get my business manager. I mean, no, business manager was introduced sometimes in 2015 or 16. So for many years, my business manager was not verified. And in fact, I did not miss anything. Okay, so as of what I'm looking at right now, you actually won't miss any feature if even if you don't have your business manager verified. But nonetheless, if you want it verified, I think the easiest way is I think there are many website service providers like GoDaddy, you can buy a domain and then uh, you can actually park it at the, you know, kind of like a landing page, which is like a domain coming soon kind of thing. And then you can create an email address at a very, very, very minimal cost. I don't think it's a cost that we should avoid if you really want to run business for long term, right? So that's for Gomez. Thank you so much for your question.